Hi, I'm Victor Cohen. This is the MCAT for Victory Anki course, and today we're going to talk about how to create a new Anki deck and how to make new cards. It is important that you personalize the Anki flashcards as much as possible. It is a good habit to edit the cards by adding personal anecdotes, images from the internet, and additional information from other sources. Sometimes, you may also want to make your own cards to include some additional information you believe will be useful in your MCAT prep. I also highly recommend creating a new personalized Anki deck based on your incorrect practice questions from question banks and practice tests. So, to create a new deck, open Anki and click on the button at the bottom of the screen that says Create Deck. For our purposes, I will label this deck Wrong MCAT Questions. You can make this deck into a subdeck by dragging it under another deck, but we will keep it separate. The first thing you're going to want to do is click the gears icon and select Options. Make sure the Options group is set to MCAT for Victory, then press OK. Now, make sure the deck is selected by clicking on it. We will now begin to add new cards. To add a card, press A on your keyboard or select the Add button at the top of the screen. I recommend setting the type of card to a closed deletion. Fill in the blank cards are very effective to quickly memorize a large amount of information. Then, make sure the correct deck is selected. For our purposes, I'm going to make the card say, the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. To make a closed deletion, highlight the word you want to be blank and select the button with the brackets around an ellipses. You can also create a closed deletion by highlighting the word and pressing Command Shift C on the keyboard. Notice how there are currently two cards on this note. In other words, this flashcard has two closed deletions. To combine these two cards into one, change the C2 into C1. This card will now read, the blank is the blank of the cell, which doesn't make much sense. So let's change it back to two closed deletions. Now, one of the cards will say, the blank is the powerhouse of the cell, and another card will say, the mitochondria is the blank of the cell. You may want to add some additional information or images to the extra section. I also prefer to keep my cards organized by using tags. To create a tag, type out how you would like to label the card. Using two colons creates subtags with the hierarchical tags add-on. This card, for example, can be tagged wrong underscore q colon colon bio biochem colon colon cell. Let's add this card. Notice how the tags remain on the screen until you exit, which is very useful when adding new cards related to the same subjects. Let's now try to find our new cards by using the Anki browser. First, go back to the Anki main screen and press B or click on Browse. On the left, we can see our new deck and we can see the new tags we created. When we click on the tag, we can find the cards we just made. And that's where I'm going to end this episode. In this video, we covered how to add new cards and new decks. Next episode, we will go over how to use Anki statistics.